Former spy chief just admits there, there's a deep state war against POTUS Trump by Josh, Joshua Kaplan for the Gateway Pundit. There is no larger threat to the establishment than President Trump. Since the billionaire real estate tycoon announced his candidacy for President of the United States, intelligence officers, both past and present, supported his rival, Hillary Clinton. In a revealing interview with Politico, former CIA Deputy Director Mike Morrell seemingly admitted the intelligence community waged war against then-candidate Trump. Has the war subsided or only gained speed? As Zero Hedge points out, not only had Morrell during his previous New York Times op-ed stated that he was committed to doing everything I can to ensure that she is elected as our 45th president, but he went so far as to call then-candidate Trump's Trump a threat to our national security while making the extraordinary claim that in the intelligence business we would say that Mr. Putin had recruited Mr. Trump as an unwitting agent of the Russian Federation. As the Washington Examiner's Byron York pointed out, a light bulb had suddenly gone off in Morrell's head. Maybe it wasn't a great idea to leak against bash a new president, York sums up. As Zero Hedge points out, below is a key exchange in the political interview. Glasser, okay, so flash forward a year, was that a mistake, Morell? So I don't think it was a mistake. I think there were downsides to it that I didn't think about at the time. I was concerned about what is the impact it would have on the agency, right? Very concerned about that, thought that through. Uh, but I don't think I fully thought through the implications. And one of the ways I've thought about that, Susan, is, okay, how did Donald Trump see this, right? And from its very important, one of the things we do as intelligence analysts is make sure that our uh, guy, the president, understands the other guy, right? So let's put ourselves here in Donald Trump's shoes. So what does he see, right? He sees a former director of CIA and a former director of NSA, Mike Hayden, who I have the greatest respect for, criticizing him and his policies, right? And he could rightfully have said, uh, what's going on with these intelligence guys, right? Morrell here seems to confirm Trump's narrative on events concerning Russiagate fake news and willful intelligence leaks intended to damage the president despite his opening obfuscation of I don't think it was a mistake. So he's essentially admitting the negative consequences but with no regrets. As more events unfold, intelligence officials reveal the deep state's inner thoughts concerning President Trump appearing to confirm both his and his supporters' deepest fear. Fears. It is any, is it any wonder the president is mulling a plan to build anti-deep state communications infrastructure? As reported by The Intercept, the Trump administration is considering proposals developed by Blackwater founder Eric Prince and a retired CIA officer in an effort to provide CIA director Mike Pompeo and the White House with a global private spy network that would go around the U.S. official swamp-infested intelligence agencies. Reportedly, the proposals would see an army of spies with no official cover in numerous countries that are denied areas for current American intelligence personnel, like North Korea and Iran. Included in the proposals are the consideration of creating a new global rendition unit with the goal of capturing terrorist suspects around the world, a propaganda campaign in the Middle East and Europe to combat Islamic extremism, 
was considered in the proposals as well. And again, who's, who's funding the extremism, uh, extremists, you see? The swamp creatures, the swamp creatures. And you see that our system, it, that's why he's setting up this new system, because uh, there's a whole narrative going on with the media to trash Trump because the deep state is who runs the media and everything else and they're losing their power and Trump doesn't want them listening in either so he's going to circumvent the communications I mean you know I don't even understand how Trump even actually wanted to become president you know I mean with all this that's going on and Clinton is so involved, so deep-rooted, because she's actually the puppet of the deep state in order to take down America. That's their plan. I mean, uh, you know, it, it, the, this, you see the roots that they're showing in Washington? They're running very deep. Um, I just, you know, pray that uh, Trump can... Uh, undo those roots, at least uh, chop off at least most of them. But uh, you can see that the, that the, there are a lot of networks, underground networks, you see? This picture, it's, it's, it's worth a million uh, words right there. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.